What's going on guys? My name is Ezel and this is my wife. Yosa. And welcome to our reaction channel, The, the Ezels React. Now, today we are checking out Marvel Studios What, what if? if. And you were saying this was Chadwick Boseman's final performance. Wow. Rest in peace, Chadwick Boseman. Phenomenal actor. He, you know, I knew him most, I'm not gonna lie, for um, Black Panther. Iconic film. Um, and I knew him most from a whole bunch of other films before that. You know, he did the James Brown movie. He did oh, yeah. Jackie Robinson. Right I saw that. Yeah, he was good. Excellent performances in majority of the movies that he's I been think, in. I think the reason why that stands out of my mind with Black Panther is because I'm a superhero nerd. So, yes, I saw the James Brown joint. Well, I still saw the, what was it, the Bridges? It was something about Bridges or something. I think he was I a police officer. About. Yeah, 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 and yeah. He was trying to solve a case, like... Yeah, we saw that movie. Yeah, we saw that movie. I can't think of the name of it. Um, but out of all of those, the few things that I have seen from Black Panther. Um, yeah, so rest in peace uh, to Chadwick Boseman. But we're about to check out this Marvel Studios video. Let's stop blabbering. You guys want to see this reaction, so let's check it out. Yeah, peace. I love peace. I'd oh, be out of a wow. job with peace. <sighs> Do we know each other? Time. Reality. Reality. It's changeable. want to be that's the question isn't it every universe is different each one unique slow down a little bit there's a few people in the room that don't understand not me i i get it Carter. I am the Watcher. I observe all that transpires here. But I do not, cannot, will not interfere. I guess I have to freestyle then. A ravager never flies solo. I said never flies solo. Uh, is that some kind <laughs> of catchphrase? Got him. Got him. Oh, nice. You had me worried for a second. Journey to face the unknown and ponder the question. Dope, dope, dope. So here's the thing. Um, according to, I guess, what I had read, Marvel Studios ha has been creating animated series. Like, they started in 2000. I think it was either 2018, 2019. Okay. So this was before the pandemic. So they actually have a lot of um, animated series kind of already in the works. Oh, on the back. Yeah. Oh, wow. Mm -hmm. So they can just crank out. They've been working this whole time nonstop, probably editing probably. And, and getting things together. Um so this is one of many that is yes. probably to come. Yes. Oh, that is that is dope. Um, what you think? I'm. I just thought about this. There's quite a few uh, Marvel joints that we need to go and watch together because we have not seen everything. We have not seen everything. We've seen a lot, but not everything. For instance, all of the Avengers movies. We haven't seen all. I still haven't seen Age of Ultron. I haven't seen all of them. Still haven't seen Age of Ultron. I mean, yeah, you can get angry, but. Um, I need to see Age of Ultron. We need to see. Uh, the, I still haven't seen all the Tony Stark joints. All the Iron I Man joints. I have seen all the Iron Man movies. Yeah, I saw the first one, but I missed two. And three. I don't even know how many there are. Um, so, yeah, I need to do a little bit of homework before I can watch this and, and appreciate it um, for the masterpiece it probably is. 
or the fun side story. I don't know which one because it's it's what if. So I don't know what it, what are they saying that this is this isn't canon, but what if kind of like Dragon Ball? Uh, what's the Dragon Ball Super uh, Superstar? What was that name of that? Uh, I really didn't like. Uh, it's Dragon Ball. It's like all the alternate universes. Goku, Dragon Ball Z, uh, Dragon Ball GT, Goku meets Dragon Ball Z Goku, uh, Dragon Ball Super Goku, excuse me, so, Dragon Ball Goku Super Saiyan Level 4 meets Ultra Instinct, yeah, I don't, I don't know, sorry, I'm I'm going on a side rant, but, yeah, I don't know if this is one of those things where there's alternate universes and made-up stories that are not canon, and they're just what-if scenarios, because, I know this, uh, I don't remember, um, what's his name from, um, Pan- Black Panther, the, the enemy, the, uh, the one that Michael B. Jordan played, what's his name, his character, I forgot his character, I can't recall, he threw the, was like he, on the Stark the Industries, like, the, the, the missile gets there, and then he's like, <gasps> and then he's, I don't remember that, and that was, it was, it's like a scene from Iron Man 1, I do know that, I remember that from Iron Man 1, and there was something, something happened, and then the military trucks and everything, and I don't remember that. I'm pretty certain that didn't happen. I know it didn't happen, so I'm like, this is the what if. This is, what if it changed, it went like this instead, so, I don't know. I don't know. Um, I guess we would have to see. I guess that's to see. really yeah. what the synopsis of the storyline will be. So guys, let us know what you think about this. I didn't this. get to tell you what I thought. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so oh sorry. Oh my I'm so goodness. Sorry. I'm, I'm sorry, guys. I completely forgot. What do you think about this? Anyways, I actually liked it. Um, I thought it was interesting that the animation style was very different from what I thought Marvel would put out. For some reason, it kind of gives me... Um, like a... It reminds me of like this... Um, this game that I played years ago it kind of had that type of style of animation it was like a, a game that I played on my phone oh, but it okay, was through okay. a certain studio I don't know I, I actually oh I know what game you're talking about you're talking about Telltale game yes Telltale. oh yeah 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 yeah. it kind of gave me that like the animation style kind of gave me that feel yeah it did so, I don't think um, what it does yeah I don't know I just I think that it'll be this will be good and I'm also excited to see what else that they release. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, so guys, leave us a comment down below and let us know. What is this what if series all about? What do you know about this what if series? Because we don't know. We don't know. You know, um, no. let us know that. Also, guys, make sure you give us a like because we're putting out videos daily and we're growing in the algorithm. Also, if this is your first time checking us out, consider subscribing because we're going to be putting out these videos like Boom Boom Bow Bow, reacting to various different content on the internet. So do that for us. Leave a comment down below and peace.